Last stop, the neon house. Mom is gonna flip out when she sees what's in the box. Come on, Neonlicious, it's time for you to get over your fears. Don't come any closer. Mom, 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 mom! Roxy got out of her cage. She could be anywhere. Ahara! You were grounded. You're watching TT Toys and Dolls. Meow, meow. Neonlicious, would you mind going to the bus stop and waiting for your brother and sister? Uh, sure, mom. I want them to come straight home after school because Dazzle's coming over for dinner. Ah, oh, cool! My older sister Dazzle is going to college here. And she comes over during the weekends. And since she now lives in the college dorms, I got to move into her room. Let me write one more answer and I'll go to the bus stop. Oh, I better enjoy the calm before the storm. Okay, the bus is kind of taking forever. Oh, I hear it. Last stop, the neon house. Okay, kids, have a nice weekend. Thank you. You too. Bye, Mrs. Nancy. Bye, Mrs. Fancy Nancy. Have a nice weekend. Carl, please don't call me that. Goodbye. Oh, look. Nan's waiting for us. Hey, guys. Mom is going to flip out when she sees what's in the box. No, she won't. Come on. Hey guys! Hey guys, how was school? Hi, Neonlicious! Hey sis! Why are you waiting for us at the bus stop today? Well, mom wanted you guys to come straight home because Dazzle's coming over for dinner. Carl, what's in the box? Uh, my apologies, Neonlicious, but that is classified information. Uh, alrighty then. Let's go, kids. Come on, Carl, don't stay behind. I want to see Dazzle, I miss her. Yeah, our cool older sister. Hey, Mom, I got my brother and sister. Thank you so much, sweetheart. I'm just going to finish my homework real quick. Hey, Mother. Hi, Mommy. Hi, guys. How was school? Really good. I got to move my clip up in class today because I was uh, setting good examples and making good choices. Oh, that's so nice. How about you, Carl? <laughs> What's in that big box? Well... Today in science class, Mr. Cooney had sort of an emergency and he asked who would volunteer to take the class pet home for the weekend. And of course, me, being an animal lover, I said I would take him. Oh, wow, Carl, that's a big responsibility. Kind of wish your teacher would have called to ask um, if to see if that was okay, but so show us your class pet. Who would trust you to take care of their pet for the weekend? Thanks for believing in me, Neonlicious. Um, this is Roxy. You want to meet her? Come, take a peek. She's a cute little little baby snake. Ah! Carl, you know I hate snakes. How could you do that? Oh, wow, a snake. I was not expecting that. I was expecting a cute little hamster or a goldfish, but, but a snake? Are you sure you can take care of a snake for the weekend? I mean, like, you have to feed him and everything. Mom, her name is Roxy. It's a female. And, um, can I know everything about snakes? I am always the one helping in the class. You can ask my, you can ask Neon Cutie. That's true. Carl always helps Mr. Cooney with Roxy. Mm-hmm. And she is really friendly. Don't worry. Look. Come on, Neonlicious. It's time for you to get over your fears. Come give her a little pet. Carl, I'm warning you. Don't come any closer. It's okay, Roxy. Go back in your box. Go back. Go on. Go on. It's okay. Carl, what exactly are you going to feed Roxy today? Um, Mr. Kuna usually gives her, like, mice and stuff, but he told me to, like, keep it simple and give her a frog. Ew. <laughs> it's okay, young kitty. It's just for the weekend. I am so stressing right now. Carl, please make sure you keep that snake inside its box and away from me in my room. Uh, yeah, duh. Today I'm filming my very first YouTube Live for my YouTube channel. And I can't have anybody ruining it, okay? My YouTube career is really taking off. I have 100 subscribers. And I'm going to be answering questions live. So that means I can't make any mistakes. Don't worry, sweetheart. We'll make sure that nobody interrupts. My friend Jesse has like... 500 subscribers and he posts videos of his littlest 
pet shop toys. What's in there on this pet shop? Exactly. He's more famous than you, Neolicious. Because I am your mature older sister, I will take my homework to my bedroom. Mom, please let me know when Dazzle's here for dinner. At least Mom is supportive of my YouTube career. I am too, Neolicious. I liked and subscribed um, on all three of our iPads. Thank you, sis. I don't know. I think I want to give your teacher a call. I don't know if you're really ready to take care of a snake for the weekend. Mom, please trust me. I can handle this. Mr. Quinny trusts me for a reason. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to go hang out with Roxy. I have a bad feeling about this. Okay, my studio lights are on. My camera. This is going to be the best YouTube life ever. Imagine if I become a famous YouTuber. Oh, that would be so epic. I wonder if I can teach my snake some really cool new tricks. I bet I could. Roxy, you are such a smart snake. I wonder if you can like totally race. That would be epic. Whoa, 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 no, 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 no. Don't think about it, Roxy. Go back in your little box. Carl, we're having dinner. Your sister's here. Okay, stay here. After I eat my dinner, I'll give you your dinner. Hello, fam. I am back. Hi, sweetie. Dinner's almost ready. Oh, mom, look at all these delicious veggies. You're always so supportive. Hey, little sis. Hi, Dazzle. I'm doing my first YouTube live today. Oh, really? Then let me fix your hair, honey. What is going on here? Hi, Dazzle. Mwah. Hi, baby sis. And where is my cutie little brother? Hi, neon guy. Thanks, you're the only one that calls me by my cool nickname. Okay, guys, everybody sit down. We're gonna eat dinner. Too bad Dad's on a business trip. He's missing out on all the fun. Okay, everyone, enjoy your dinner. So, Carl, have you been staying out of trouble? Honestly, sister, I've been trying to stay out of trouble, but for some reason, trouble always seems to follow me, you know? Can't even help it. But his teacher let Carl take the class pet home for the weekend. That shows that he thinks you're really responsible. Wow, impressive, little brother. <laughs> yeah, and guess what it is? It's a snake. Whoa, I didn't even know they had those kind of class pets. Mom, my new friends from school invited me to watch a movie with them. I know I just came here, but do you think I can go? It's been really hard making new friends. I can understand that. We had a really nice dinner together. You can go ahead and go to a movie with your friends. Yeah, so I'll be in my room for like two hours doing my life and stuff, so. And I'm gonna be doing a zombies movie marathon. We're better than ever, better than ever, woo! And I'm super busy babysitting Roxy, so. Don't worry, sister. Go live your life. Okay, then. I'll be excused. Dinner was delicious. Give daddy hugs for me. Bye, guys. I'll probably come over tomorrow. Bye, everyone. Bye, Dazzle. Thanks for dinner, Mom. Time to feed my sweet little Roxy. I wonder why he put the frog in. Yuck. Here you go, little neon cutie. More broccoli. All right, guys. I'm going to my room. Nobody comes in and bothers me, please. Thanks. Good luck with your live video, sweetheart. Hey guys, it's Neonlicious. Thanks for tuning in to my channel. Today we're doing some questions and answers. I have all the questions here on my phone and I will be answering them. Jesse from Texas asked, Am I a visco girl? Well, that's kind of a complicated question actually. Huh? <gasps> the box is empty! Roxy! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. How could this happen? She never leaves her box. Boy, am I gonna be in big trouble. So, I love scrunchies. I love seashell necklaces. I love the turtles, but I'm not a visco girl. <laughs> if that answers your question. Ah, finally. I can sit down, relax, and watch my favorite shows. Mom, 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 mom! What happened? Ow! Carl, what happened? Nearly knocked me out of my chair. Ro we ha I have bad news, mom. Roxy got out of her cage. She could be anywhere. What? Carl, you had one job, sweetie. 
Oh, great. And your sister's up there filming her life? We have to keep it down. I told you I had a bad feeling about this. Come on, Aunt Cutie, you need to help me find her. If, if Roxy is gone, I will never be able to show my face in school again. I don't even know where to look. That slippery snake could be anywhere. Let's split up. You look over there in the kitchen. I'll go look in the living room and the dining room. I'll look in the bedrooms and in the bathroom. But please, try not to disturb your sister. Her YouTube life is a big deal for her. Okay, I'll try. Yeah, we'll try. Come on. This snake could be anywhere. I knew this was a bad idea. I told Carl. Nothing in the mini fridge. Nope, no Roxy here. Roxy, where are you? Great. Mr. Cooney is going to be so mad at me. He's probably going to fail me from his class. Roxy. Oh, brother. So there was no Roxy in the kids' room and apparently nothing in the bathroom. Okay, I am getting really worried. Where could Roxy be? Another super awesome burning question is, you guys wanna know what YouTubers I don't like? And this is a really juicy one, so stick around for this answer. <laughs> Tickles. Huh? Ah! Ah! Snake! Snake! Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! My camera! Snake! Ah! Carl! Get here right now! Bingo, I think Roxy was found. Oh, brother. Roxy. Yeah, you can say that you just got me in big trouble. Okay, Mr. Cooney. Perfect. Carl, Mr. Cooney's coming over to pick up Roxy. Okay, Mom. Are you still mad at me, Neolicious? Am I still mad at you? Am I still mad at you? Everyone saw me yelling and screaming during my YouTube live video. My YouTube career is over because of you. I didn't mean for this to happen, Yolishas. I'm really sorry. It still happened, okay? I need some time to forgive you. I feel really bad about it. Thankfully, you only have 100 followers and four of them is Neon Cutie on different IDs. Oh, that's Mr. Cooney. Goodbye, Roxy. I'm sorry I failed you. Uh, good evening, Mrs. Neon. I apologize for any inconvenience Roxy may have cost you and your family. Maybe next time you might want to talk to the parents before you let one of your students take Roxy. Of course, and Carl told me that you had allowed him to bring Roxy home this weekend. No, I never said that. Okay, I understand what's going on here. Carl? Mr. Cooney? Come on, Roxy, let's go home. I'll see you on Monday. Aw, Mr. Cooney is so disappointed in me. He's probably never ever gonna let me take Roxy ever again. We have bigger problems, Carl. Like me being the laughing stock of the whole world. Huh, it's Swag calling me. Hello? Neon Lishes, you won't believe this. Your video went viral. Everybody is loving it and sharing it, and everyone says that you are amazing and so hilarious. Really? And you just got like 500,000 new subscribers. No way! People actually think that was funny? They loved it. I gotta see it for myself. It's true! This is crazy! Okay, I guess this is the part where you say, thank you, Carl. You're the best little brother in the whole entire world. Not exactly. Oh, I'm gonna be Oh no, mister. Don't think you're off the hook so quickly. You were grounded for lying to Mr. Cooney. Oh, brother. Did I mention to you guys I had a bad feeling about this?